Hey guys, Nick here. Today I'm going to show you how to create a table within NIME without having to actually create the table in Excel and then save it and then use the Excel reader node. So basically we'll take some data from Excel and then almost literally plug it right into NIME. So first goal today, if you look within this little annotation, is that you want to create one table that shows all categories of a product that's sold at our corporate owned stores and then the second table we want to create uh, is a table showing all the corporate owned stores so just to show you guys how I'm going to do this without actually saving an Excel file and almost directly writing the table into NIME first I gotta show you the actual data right so these are the categories that we sell within our corporate owned stores and then these are our corporate owned stores store number followed by the date so we'll start first with the category sold within the corporate owned stores so first off we're going to take only the categories not the column header right only the actual categories we'll copy them actually let's not copy them yet let's first start off in nine i'm going to want you to search in your not in your node repository for a table if I can spell that correctly, table creator node, right? So this is how the magic's done with this node. And in this node, you if you double click to uh, set the configuration, you can essentially just literally take your data and that you've copied and paste it into this uh, spreadsheet, right? So it's as easy as this, right? Like I said before, we're gonna take the categories. We don't need the column header. And take the categories, copy them, and then literally paste them right into this spreadsheet, right? And now the column header, see right now it says column one. You're just going to double click, and now you get this little pop up where you can change the name of the column. So we'll say category, we'll just say cat, short for category. And then you can even change the, um, the type of, um, like whether you have a string or a double or an integer etc we're going to keep this as a string because that's what we're working with here gonna hit ok and then i'm going to hit apply oh okay and then i'm going to execute and now when you look at the output of the node right click hit manually create a table and now you can see we've got our categories within a nice table right and then we're gonna do the second table the table that shows all corporate owned stores we're gonna do the same thing pull in a table creator node and we're gonna be a little responsible with this and name this one as CO for corporate owned and then stores so we'll use a subheader to give some detail there you can also fix this one. We're going to say categories. All right. Now for our actual store list, we're going to double click again to configure the node. Go back to our Excel list. And in the CO stores tab, I have the store numbers followed by the state the store is located in. I'm simply going to copy the data without the column headers, right? Highlight, copy, go back to NIME and paste the data within the table creator configuration. And then again, I'm going to double click where it says the column names, the temporary column names, so I can rename them what I'd like to do, what I'd like to name them as. Here we're going to say store store number we're gonna keep this as a string for now because I don't really want to manipulate these store numbers they're just no numbers Th these to me are more dimensions than they are um, something you perform a calculation you can like like you don't sum up store numbers right so we keep it as a string hit OK and then we'll go over to column 2 double click and then we'll say name this one state if I can spell that correctly this is also a string hit OK hit apply hit OK so now the node is configured you can tell by the yellow the yellow uh, dot or the L status so now we'll right click 
execute the tables executed and that ladies and gentlemen is how we create uh, tables within NIME or how we manually create manual tables within NIME and like always hit the like button hit the subscribe button share this video with your friends and if you have any questions or any comments just leave them in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as I can otherwise I'll catch you guys on the next video